What's up guys, here is your boy Sergi and John Fans channel. Today I will tell you about some new awesome upgrade which I get for my Yamaha DDX452K. The story goes like this. Here I was digging into 65 pages of the owner's manual. And my eyes stopped on some very curious stuff. Integrating separately sold accessories. So there is more stuff with this shit. What? You can make this set even better? Wait, I know what it is. A freaking beer holder. Man, that is the only thing which were missing. Ah, oh, thank you, Yamaha. Ah, no, you fool! It's additional symbol. Like a symbol of darkness. No, 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 guys! It's additional crash symbol. So the first thing I did, I looked up this device in YouTube, obviously. But for some reason, I didn't find like any specific video dedicated to this symbol. No review, no unpacking, no nothing. The only good video where you can see like a performance of this symbol is this video. You go, sister! Arigato! I tried to buy it from my local official Yamaha store, but they said that it will be available in 6 months! 6 months, man! I was like really sad, because I just couldn't wait for 6 months to receive my new symbol. But one good guy told me that you could buy all Yamaha stuff at Rakuten Global, Japanese online market. I go there and find this symbol for like $120 and I receive it in only 3 weeks! Damn! Thank you Rakuten, you rock! Or should I say... Rakut? So as you see, the symbol goes to the right side of the rack. You can move a little bit floor time and to have like an empty space for this symbol. And it also has like uh, many uh, stuff which you can calibrate. You can calibrate the height of this symbol and like the angle which you want. So it's like really up to you to do it uh, as comfortable as you want. And the set is looking something like this. Okay, so after you plug this baby in, it is a second crash symbol, which gives you like a rich, highlighted, powerful crash sound. So, this baby gives to your set more sound variability. And as you know, there is no such thing as too many symbols. Also, I'm sure that with the software like Addictive Drums, you can change the sound of this symbol to any other kind you want. It could be like a splash symbol or like a China kind symbol, like a turn inside out. Also, it's called trash symbol. By the way, did you know that the term crash symbol was implemented by a frequently famous symbol producer Zildjian in 1928. I wonder how they called it before that. Well, I guess this is the story for a documentary video which I will definitely going to make. But as for now, let's check how this baby sounds. <laughs> 